usap tayo saglit. So, November 1 ngayon at konti lang yung tao sa labas. So, it's best time to talk to you guys. Status, status, status ko sa, sa trabaho. So, it's 21 days na lang I'll be leaving dun sa yung current job ko sa papunta sa bagong job. So, I've As you all know, I'm still a team leader sa BPO and I'll be moving out soon sa current company ko. And it's been 10 years. It's 10 grateful years kasi, you know, dito ako sa current company ko na, na I think grown so much, learned so much, failed so much, challenged so much. And boy... I'm I'm still grateful because no matter what God put me through or bring me through this and fortunately I'll be I'll be part of another company soon by 25th of November this month so I just I just want to share how thankful I am and you should be thankful too sa sa current company kung nagtatrabaho ka pa dyan sa company mo. And you have to be thankful kasi you still have a job. Kasi iba walang trabaho. Wala ng trabaho. And sad to say yung isang LOB na, well, yung mga back, some of our back offices had had gone gone out. Nawala na. Nawala na sila. Kasi you know it's it's a client requirement so most likely nang reduce ng headcount and or probably in acquire na ng mga onshore counterpart namin yung mga, yung mga line of businesses na meron kami before so sad to say na well those familiar faces you won't see them anymore yung mga dating team leads na nakikita mo yung mga dating agents na nakikita mo so hindi mo na sila makikita. So, you have to be thankful. Okay? Kasi, you don't know kung anong, anong mangyayari in the future. So, as you are being grateful, you still have to prepare. Be be brave enough to prepare na nothing is fixated at nothing is permanent. Anything can change your, your client's decision can change. Your vendors mo would change. The business would change. The market would change. The people around you would change. Everything can change. But what doesn't change is God is always there to, to bring you through. If He bring you through it, He'll, he'll definitely get out of you from it. So, so anong, anong pinagdadaanan mo, challenges mo, problema mo ngayon, just just bring up there, you know, talk to him, pray, and soon enough, you'll see na it's okay. Still good, kasi you've, you've gone through so much, you're still there, dyan ka pa, Marami ka pang pwedeng gawin and that's why you're there to serve others. And you still have a good life kasi yung iba dyan, diba, had more problems than you. Mas maraming problema kaysa sa'yo. So you have to be, you have to be grateful. At the same time, prepare for everything, okay? Save up, save up your money, always build up a good relationship with other people kasi you don't know kung saan magagaling yung susunod mong job partnership business pwedeng sa ibang tao eh. so you have to cultivate great relationship okay so that you know yung next next grace mo blessing is probably coming from other other people but just God use them to to connect with you and you know 
cultivate that relationship para both kayo mag mag benefit at mag mag thrive at the same time so that's why connection is is key okay real connection is key so connect with someone and ensure na you think as if you're there to serve them okay you're there to to help them okay it's not it's not for you personally show yourself present yourself as if you can share and help other people okay so be grateful be prepared as always and at the same time serve others okay trust me you'll be more joyful okay have a good day